Okay guys, welcome to my new video, and also this is going to be a great, um, a short, quick video, and also it's going to have some great things inside it. We are going to be talking about whether, you know, Cody's finally over. We did go through Bitcoin in my previous video, and I'm keeping this short and sweet. As you can see here, I'm going to change this to USD, okay, so we can actually look at it in dollar, because most of you guys are American, and uh, as of right now, we did see that massive drop down in um, Bitcoin, which as you can see is happening as we speak, 30k, and uh, yeah, 28k is literally around the corner so it is kind of scary to see that you know we are seeing this massive um drop down uh by bitcoin and uh yeah it's scary how it's actually played out exactly how we wanted it to play out and you can actually check out my previous videos where we actually do go through bitcoin and we literally play show you guys it doing this so you can go and check that out and uh yeah it's quite interesting as of right now to see where bitcoin is actually heading to and 28k is looking more and more likely as days go by and unfortunately Everyone's, you know, saying 28k right now, and um, everyone's wanting to see a massive bounce there, but I want to see us go through it, in my opinion, just because, you know, the market doesn't really um, respect what people's opinions are. It's not run on emotions, and uh, you probably heard me say this before, it's all algorithmic, algorithmic, if I can see it. So yeah, as of right now, you know, Bitcoin is quite interesting. So if I go to Koti, as you guys may know, Koti right here. This one is kind of interesting because if we go to the weekly time frame, you know, it is very, very bearish. An area where if we were bullish, we should have seen it sweep low and run higher. But as you can see, as of right now, it is not doing that. So in my opinion, I do think the logical target would be around 0 0.1 and uh, potentially even go lower than that. So if we did go below 0 0.1, then this is going to be quite a hectic bear market. Or we could just go below 0 0.1 and rally higher or just hit this as a support level and then start to rally even higher. So there's a lot of ifs and there's a lot of buts, but that's, you know, where we are currently right now. We are currently uncertain, but everything's really playing out to what we, you know, like and currently require for us to have a amazing time in the future because, you know, this bullish phase, as you can see right here, doesn't happen all the time, okay? This is something that tends to happen, you know, it is not something that is guaranteed. A bull run is not 100%, but when Bitcoin halves, it kind of does give it a likely chance of it to kind of give us a bull run because, well, I'll save that for my next video, but briefly you know a bull run is needed especially when there's not enough um supply demand demand kind of increases for bitcoin because they do half the supply and that kind of gives more scarcity for not only bitcoin but all the other altcoins as well given you know hype and a boost in price and market cap new investors and uh, just a constant loop <laughs> almost like a ponzi scheme but uh, yeah i'm not going to speak about that so yeah as of right now you know we are currently um looking very suspect for Cozy and I do think we are going to be dropping lower to 0 0.1 and unfortunately if you don't take profits guys in the future but just make sure you take profits this is not something that you know is um you should really dwell on because you know this is a learning lesson I know, I know there's a lot of people out there that have made millions from this run even from here to here but guys keep in mind this is a lesson this is always going to be here there's always going to be a market whether it's the wheat market whether it's the foreign exchange market or the crypto market commodity market stock market whatever whatever it is okay there's always going to be a market so if you just understand to take profit you're always going to be a winner okay so don't be annoyed at yourself okay because that's just going to make you not want to do this anymore so think think long term and think that you are still in the learning stage just so that you understand that regardless of what happens regardless if your coins are dropping in value you know you've you've learned a lesson take profits don't invest into projects that you've not thoroughly done research on and have no idea what they're doing so yeah that's that's a lesson that I'd like to say and um, yeah hopefully this has kind of like boosted your emotions and not maybe kind of depressed because this is depressing and I'm personally holding Koti okay so yeah, if if uh, if that makes you guys feel better, you know I'm down, everyone's down, and uh, yeah, we just we just need to wait and see what happens in the future, and potentially we can expect prices to uh, you know give us that massive bullish phase which we are all hoping for. We all want it to go to the moon, but you know it's not really offering that right now. So yeah, as of right now, you know we just need Bitcoin to kind of reach 28k, and then we can actually see what happens next. But yeah, guys, hopefully you've enjoyed this video. And as always, I'm always going to be honest with you guys. And uh, yeah, if you found this channel helpful, leave a like, subscribe, and sh um, share this video. And comment down below if you think um, these videos do help you guys. Whether, you know, this video helps you or the previous videos do help you. Anyways, uh, peace.